so next part is wireless application protocol WAP okay so wireless application protocol having a specific goal which is a set of communication protocol uh, having a standards to make accessing online services from mobile phone simple okay now the first one is it is a motivation for developing the web uh, was to extend the internet technologies to wireless network bearers and devices okay uh, we are using a various uh, wireless devices and various channels uh, across the various networks so uh, there are some specifications are written uh, for or the standards are written over here which are helpful to access the various network services over uh, wireless media so it is initially conceived by four companies uh, ericsson motorola nokia and wired planet uh, today is called as a phone.com and the wireless forum is uh, in industry association to promote the wireless application protocol so here is the uh, structure of your wireless application protocol you can see that uh, wml micro browser you can consider it as a uh, browsers which are used for uh, to access the internet connectivity you can consider it as a chrome uh, browser, uh, chrome mozilla and uh, other things uh, so this browser uh, over here whenever the uh, the request uh, is uh, uh, sent by this uh, uh, mobile station the gsm over the gsm network this re uh, encoded request is passed to the wireless uh, application protocol gateway so this gateway is responsible for encoding uh, accepting this encoding request and then uh, generate a new request which is understandable by orient origin server okay the server which is responsible for providing the services to your wml uh, micro browser or on your mobile system so first of all this request is came to the gateway gateway generate the another request for your server server checks whether uh, existing request is came uh, with your system or not okay if the existing system is came with your uh, then it will just passes to wml request wireless markup language request to the wap and then gateway is uh, directly uh, uh, or uh, gateway is response with the encoded wml message with the your browser system okay so it will verify all your uh, verification or uh, check the existing request came from uh, or is there any new request came from so if the new request is came uh, you just uh, stored that request over here just uh, accept this request uh, in the form of a wml response and passes this uh, information to the mobile station okay so this is how the wireless application protocol works uh, but now the this protocol system having a specific uh, model and uh, which is provided a specific uh, uh, security mechanism that is uh, it provide end to end security if the communication is using wireless protocol it provide the end to end security micro browsers are considered as a micro browsers are considered as a your uh, general browser which are uh, nothing but uh, uh, your uh, chrome or mozilla browsers for the wireless environment again uh, wml used in uh, handheld mobile devices and also it is a wml script which is a lightweight procedural scripting language uh, used for uh, your application model user agent is a device or software that interprets the uh, content user agent you may either uh, i also uh, told you that uh, wml that is a wireless markup language so it also act as on behalf of the user with the applications okay so there are so many um, parts of your wap protocol which is performed the, uh, on a various uh, uh, on a various platform okay again uh, this agent can be textual browser i already told you that uh, which is a browser search engine whatever and the wml document is a set of cards which is uh, representing one unit of interaction between the user and user agent okay so basic uh, unit of your uh, is a deck group of cards that the origin server can send to a user agent okay what is the responsibility of wap gateway wap gateway utilizes the web proxy technology to provide efficient wireless access to the internet i told you that uh, the mobile system uh, request is came with the 
on the basis of the various protocol but your server system is uh, working on a different protocol so to make a effective communication between mobile station and uh, server system you have to use the gateway which are responsible for transmitting the one system call into another system call which is uh, understandable by the both sides so it uh, gateway is a more important part of uh, this uh, wireless uh, wp structure or model it serves as a proxy to handle the request from wireless handset and passes it to the original server on the other internet side gateway translate the request of web protocol stack into http or tcp and so vice versa on wireless network side the it is work as a encoder decoder uh, which convert the wml text into bytecode conversion to reduce the information transmitted over the wireless network so these are all the various tasks of your wp gateway again uh, it supports to the dns service domain name system uh, which is used to resolve the identification of your url name uh, again uh, there is a distillation technique to perform uh, on demand transformation effectively reduce the wireless traffic uh, distill uh, representation allows the user to quickly retrieve a simplified version of an object Uh, that means uh, it is transparent for uh, all the necessary uh, information which is uh, transferred during uh, or uh, over the network which is mostly transferred uh, trans uh, transparent uh, mechanism is used for this uh, information representation uh, so gateway uh, belongs to the center of your uh, application and uh, another thing is that wireless application protocol yeah, the question we ask for you wp protocol stack so you have to go for this diagram and explain the each and every part of your diagram into a specific language uh, on your own language you can say that the uh, it uh, this wireless application protocol stack consist of your ip uh, based that is brs uh, transmission media brs in means uh, transmission media non ip based uh, wireless media Uh, wireless datagram protocol that is wdp user datagram protocol that is udp uh, it is over uh, both are uh, connection less services wtls that is wireless transport layer security wp that is wireless transaction protocol wireless station protocol and application environment is there okay so these are the various content of your wireless application protocol we are going to see one by one uh, wdp defined by uh, at uh, transport layer we know that transport layer working kaise hota hai it offer consistent service to the upper layer protocol of wap also used to uh, function uh, independently of the underlying wireless network also it is used as a communication mechanism between the mobile node and a wap uh, gateway okay wdp uh, hides uh, all the details of various brs network from other layers of the wap okay the, that means it uh, work as a transport layer uh, that means it identifies the node to node communication link and uh, transmit the data over the network okay so this kind of a, a protocol system is also used for partitioning data into segments for appropriate size of the brr if the brr is not a uh, Uh, brr is not uh, capable to pass your information then you have to distribute your information into a number of segment and then you have to pass it information over a uh, channels okay so this is a uh, all about your wdp working of your wdp wtls is a security purposes for security mechanism is used which is between the mobile devices and a wp gateway it is based on the tls uh transmission layer security uh, also it provide the various features like uh, data integrity privacy authentication and de denial of service protection okay data integrity that means your uh, data will not be changed uh, during the transmission privacy means uh, only sender and receiver can access it authentication means identification of origin denial of service means uh, no other users can access this information and pretend to the sender or uh, receiver or any kind of a blocking system will not be there uh, because of this uh, attack so uh, this feature can enable or disable by the application as per depend wdp 
uh, light, it is a lightweight protocol so suitable for thin client over a low bandwidth wireless link. Uh, TCP is a light uh, TCP light that is a thin client we can use. Uh, message and transaction oriented rather than the connection oriented uh, connection established or not doesn't matter but uh, message and transaction is uh, going to take place over the network okay there are three types of transaction unreliable reliable and reliable two-way request reply okay unreliable that means uh, whether data uh, reached to the destination or not doesn't matter reliable means you, uh, you have to check for it but uh, only from one side a reliable two-way means you can check the request reply uh, you can give the request and uh, uh, the uh, receiver gives you a reply for the same also provide the reliability uh, which is uh, uses as a unique transaction identifier acknowledgements duplication removal and retransmission next part is wireless session protocol it is a uh, exchange uh, or a support for client server application where the session is going to establish between client and server okay the life cycle of say a wsp session is not tied to the underlying transport when the session is idle wsp may suspend the session to release the network resources and to save the power consumption of a wsp handset again a session may be resumed at different bear network okay whenever the channel is available the session again resume for the same two type of services is provided connection oriented and connection less you know that connection oriented gives the guarantee that where the data is reached to the destination site successfully or not uh, connection less uh, will not uh, consider this kind of situation uh, if uh, data transmitted with the own uh, connection less services it doesn't matter whether they are reached to the destination or not and the uh, uh, last part of here is the wireless application environment which specifies the application framework for wireless devices it contains a number of user agents uh, which are the software that execute the wireless device again is also having a content generator which produces the standard content format uh, content encoding uh, normally we have wa user agent that is called as a browser uh, are used to define these uh, content and wireless telephony application wta which is a collection of a uh, specific extension for call and feature control mechanism okay so this is uh, all about your uh, wap stack and wae protocol stack you can consider wae over here which having a user agent user agent i already told you that uh, uh, various browsers can use number of services provided to that browsers the protocol stack number of services number of requests are stored with this protocol stack operating system works with they along with the these uh, uh, stacks and other services also provided to the stack so you are going to write it down uh, application protocol and the protocol stack the question will ask for you in examination so you have to write all these contents uh, all these things